We're here live with uh, NC State defensive end Bradley Chubb at the ACC Championship game. Bradley, <laughs> you had a lot of fun out there in that Clemson-NC State game, taking Kelly Bryant's towel. Obviously, nothing malicious meant about it. Just mm. a, a guy out there having fun with his teammates, right? right. Yes, sir. Um, I mean, if you if you watch the film, I do it every game. Um, it was just just happened I got caught this time. But um, it's just a, a little mind game I like to play. But that cause I see I see a quarterback wipe his hand on his towel before every snap. And so when I uh, when I take his towel, he gets a little frustrated and all that. But it was all in good fun, and I it got a lot of uh, got a lot of uh, not bad backlash, but a lot of people Clemson fans sending me towels and stuff like that. So it, it was funny, and uh, I enjoyed it. But it's just something I do every game. Did Kelly talk about it at all during the game, or did he tell you you know stop taking the towel? No, nah, I mean even if he did, I couldn't really hear him. Sure. But um, yeah, it was it was it was just all in fun. <laughs> What have you done with all those towels that people sent you? And were you surprised that you got a bunch of tiger paws on them? Uh, no, I'm actually not. I mean, if you get, uh, get on Twitter, um, my friend Naheem, teammate Naheem Hines, yeah. posted pictures of me with it and all that. I got a big beach towel in my in my car. Just it was it was funny, um, but I'm not surprised because I knew Clemson has a, a large fan base and I knew they were going to go all out for it. So I mean, it, it was fun and it was funny. And the next question would be, yeah, how honored are you to, to win this award? And to be here representing NC State, um, it's, it's probably one of the biggest things. Um, coming back, um, I didn't I didn't know what the season was going to hold, and for for all this to happen, and for me to get AC Defensive Player of the Year, is just a, a blessing. A lot of great defensive players out there. Um, anybody else stand out to you? Like if you would say, "Hey, yeah, I know I'm the best, but I think this guy's somebody to watch out for." Um, I feel like if uh, Harold Landry wasn't injured for a lot of the season, he would uh, definitely be in the conversation. Uh, the two defensive ends they have at Clemson, Austin Bryant and Cleveland Flair, um, very good uh, players. Um, there's guys all over the conference I can't name. I, I know by jersey number, but I can't name off the top of my head that they're playing really good ball, and I, that's why I'm just so honored and so blessed to uh, be the defensive, defensive player of the year. My final question, do you play Clemson and play Miami this year? What's your prediction for tomorrow night? Um, Clemson's a really good team that knows how to win. So um, I feel like Miami's going to jump out, and um, Clemson's just going to have to gather it around together. And you know I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull for the Atlantic side, and I feel like Clemson's gonna pull it out. Thanks, sir. Sure.